Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this tutorial, I will show you how to design furniture banner in Photoshop. First, I will create a document 2000 by 2000. I will keep regulation 300 and color mode will be RGB. And I keep this measurement in pixel. Now I will create a rectangle. I will apply gradient in this rectangle. That's why I will double click on the layer. Here I will choose gradient overlay. I will choose this gradient this light blue color code is 00C0FM and this dark blue color code is 015EEA I keep this style in radial and red angle is 90 and scale 150 and blend mode is normal. Now I will select both cutting shift key and then I will group this two layer by pressing control. Now I will rename this background. Now I will log this layer. Now I will draw a polygon. I'll change this polygon color. Now I will select this one. That's why I will go to edit option, then free transform. Now I will rotate this. Now I will select this one again by pressing Ctrl T. I will get a little bit uh, I will copy this one by pressing control I will keep this copy layer under the first one or uh, I will change this polygon color I will keep dark blue this color code is 015EEA now I will press down arrow then left arrow I will select this one by pressing control D and I will increase a little bit the polygon size here I will use an image I will drag this image and drop it here. I will align this layer. First, I will decrease this image size. That's why I will really and click, select this one by pressing control D. Now I will decrease furniture size. I think it's perfect. Now I will right clip, right click on the furniture layer, then create clip mask. Now I will log this three layer by pressing shift key and then I will group this three layer by pressing ctrl G. I will rename this 
legend and I will lock this player. Here I will type I will decrease this font size. Here I am using develop it. I will select this text. I will copy this text by using Ctrl and Shift key. Alt and Shift key. I will rename this. I will select this layer by pressing Ctrl D. I will decrease, increase this contrast a little bit. Here I will select this. I will copy this text again by pressing Alt Shift key. I will select this one again and then align it center. I will select this one that is a control day and I will increase a little bit this one size. Now I will draw a rectangle. I will keep this rectangle under the image text. Now I will change this rectangle to color. I will keep this dark blue. Now I will copy this one by pressing all the shift key. I will increase this size by pressing control D. Now I'll type here. I will decrease the text size. Now I will check this text that is in Ctrl G. Now rename this text. I will log this one. Now I will draw a rectangle circle here by pressing all I will change this circle color. I will copy this one by pressing Ctrl G. I will keep this copy list under the first one. Then I will change this copy list color. I will keep white. Then I will press down arrow and then right arrow. I will type here. I will keep this starting center for above the all ellipse. I will copy this on the pressing all shift key. I will rename this one. Now I will copy this one by pressing Ctrl G. 
Now I will unlock the own layer. This is for the, this tutorial. If you like this tutorial, don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching.